What is an AUE on a Chromebook? Why should you consider this when purchasing a new machine? It's Ron Brown with Tech for Senior. If you have a Chromebook, you should know what the AUE is. And if you're considering purchasing a Chromebook, you should also know what the AUE is. Now you're going to say, what the heck is an AUE? And let me explain that today because there's been some big changes in the AUEs on Chromebooks. Also, this should be a vital decision in purchasing a new Chromebook because you should know what the AUE is. I also will have a new video coming out in the next couple of weeks on purchase considerations for a new Chromebook. Since we are coming up to Black Friday, Christmas, and all this time where technology sales are booming, I want to give you help on choosing the right Chromebook for your use. Now you're going to say, how I find out about that? Well, you know, just click that like and subscribe and we'll send you a notification when that new video comes, comes out about purchasing a new Chromebook. So the auto update expiration or AUE is a date that Google assigns a Chromebook at the time of manufacture. And that means it's going to provide automatic updates for that particular machine for a period of 10 years. But what if the machine was manufactured two years earlier? Well, then you would have eight years. What if it was five years earlier? Well, then you'd have five years. You see how it goes. So one of the problems with AUEs is, is that where do you find them? And I'm gonna show you how to do that in a minute, but there's no way of knowing. They don't publish the data on this uh, when you're gonna purchase it. It's not on the box, the outside of the box. You really have to open the machine up and run it and, and, and look and see exactly what the expiration date is. So you have to be really careful with that. And it would sort of be nice if you were going to purchase a Chromebook and you had three different models. It would be nice to get the one with the longest AUE, right? So you have to be a little bit concerned about that. The other thing that's really important for you to understand is that Chromebooks are sold in two different ways. First of all, they're sold to the education uh, department in schools across the United States. These Chromebooks are made specifically for schools and often have limited capabilities. These are not the Chromebooks that are sold commercially to us uh, that we buy at Best Buy, Amazon, and that are advertised all the time. These are different, different types of Chromebooks. Uh, well, they still work the same way, but they're more full featured for us. So it's important that um, you be careful, particularly if you're going to purchase a Chromebook online, a refurbished one, that you know that you could be, it could have a very shortened lifespan if it's already used up three or four years of its AUE. So be very careful with that. We're not seeing as many um, refurbished Chromebooks coming out now from school systems, because remember they're all leasebacks and then they, they, they refurbish them and put them all on, on Amazon to be sold. We're not seeing as many of those come on to Amazon now um, as, as, of course, Chrome goods get more popular and the availability for commercial products that you would buy, uh, that we would buy, consumer products that we would buy. So always be aware of the AUE date when purchasing a computer. So an automatic update expiration date is not unusual. We find that in cell phones after a certain time, um, different models of cell phones don't get automatic updates. If you come from a Windows background, it's usually the software that expires, not the hardware. But Google has decided with Chromebooks, it is going to be a hardware expiration rather than software. So it's going to provide updates for you for the life of that machine. Well, sort of. Uh, let's, let's be realistic and that most of the Chromebooks sold, probably about 95% are laptops. They all have batteries. These batteries are permanent, non-removable batteries and probably an average lifespan of about five years. I think it's very generous to get 10 years of updates. I should also comment that if you do have a Chromebook um, that you've had for over five years, you should inspect it on a regular basis for battery swelling. 
Uh, I'm going to show you on my uh, pixel book in a moment how you might want to do that, but you want to hold it up and hold it sideways and look across the keyboard. If you do see any swelling or unevenness in the keyboard, it's very important you unplug it, don't use it. It could it be it could cause um, it could explode or cause fires. It should be disposed of in promptly and and not used or kept plugged in. So please be aware of that. If you see any swelling in the keyboard, this is a very, very bad thing. Okay, now we are on the screen of my uh, Pixelbook. This is a Pixelbook that I purchased in 2019 as a refurbished machine. I suspect it probably was made in either late 2017 or 2018. Now, based on the seven years that was the original rule for AUEs on this particular machine, it should be around 2024 as the expiration date. So let's have a look and see where we are with this. So as we come down to the right side, I'm going to show you how to look up the expiration date. Just click on the shelf on the right side here. And what we're going to do is we're going to click on settings. You see settings here. Uh, we'll just click on settings. And it's going to bring up this menu here. And we're going to now come down to the bottom left. And it says about Chrome OS. I'm going to click this. And here we come up. And this is uh, tells me I'm running. I'm actually running version 117 of the Chrome OS. I want to come down. And there's lots of things here you can look at. But I want to come down to additional details. We're going to click here. And here's where you will see the automatic update schedule. Now it says um, this device will get automatic software and security updates till June of 2024. And that's about what I figured. But there has been, as I mentioned earlier, some changes that Google just made. Let's see if it affects this Chromebook. If we click learn more, this is going to bring us up to the policy, the new updated policy page for, uh, for Google. We're going to come down and we'll see Google. Let's open this up. And we now are going to have the updated list for the AUEs. So if we come down to the pixel book, which, which I have, you're going to see it's not 2024 because these have changed now. And we're going to get updates to 2027. Yes, Google just added three years. So, and that's to a machine that was built in 2017. So the important thing for you to learn from this is just because your device says that it's going to expire at this date, you should click the learn more because you will get the, the updated list right from Google and come down and look specifically for your for your device. And mine will be updated. I will get security updates for another three years. So you do notice a little asterisk after the August 27. You'll see it right there. And if you come down to the bottom here, it says these Chrome OS devices must opt in to receive extended updates. So I assume that you'll be getting an option to click on to um, extend the life of your Chromebook sometime in the future. So automatic update expiration dates are important when considering a new purchase of a Chromebook. Also, please, if you do have an older Chromebook, check the keyboard by looking sideways on the keyboard for any battery swelling. If you see any swelling, please do not use it dispose of it carefully. It could be explosive or cause a fire. Don't plug it in. Remember the like and subscribe and we'll notify you when my new video about purchase considerations for a new Chromebook comes out. Until we see you again, have a great day.